Hello guys, uh, my name is Vijay Kumar Vaka. I am working as Senior Solution Consultant in Episero. Today let us discuss about how to generate keys dynamically in DataView 2.0. Now before uh, we proceed ahead, if you want to go through this as an article, you can check uh, this article which I have written recently. I will share this link in the description of this video. Now let us go ahead. Uh, um, let us go ahead with the demo now let's take this example this is the JSON object right where we have three keys and three values okay message one message two greeting are three keys and these are the three values uh, for the for this case now uh, let's try to uh, generate these keys dynamically first of all uh, when you um, when you simply type it as a payload we we are able to see this uh, like this for example now there will be some uh, instances where uh, you have to generate these keys as well dynamically of course in this scenario we got uh, as is right now for example uh, if I'm using map object function and trying to generate uh, trying to uh, generate this as a outcome so in that case uh, because this is a JSON object right so we can only use map object here okay now here uh, while you populate the key value pairs in the output so how we can do now let us see that so if I type it as message as a key and colon value now what happened all the keys got generated as uh, message only every time now in order to um, generate these keys uh, dynamically uh, as we have in the input uh, let us try with uh, uh, key now what happened when you type key as a key here it took uh, it as a hard-coded value now how can we generate this particular key dynamically so that is the that is what uh, we will we'll see now so so in order to do this we have two ways they are like these are the two different ways now let me cut it here and I'll comment I'll paste here okay now let us see this is the first way so copy this or yeah so if I if I uh, right this way now you see uh, the key the keys got uh, mapped dynamically in the output right you could see this message one message two and greeting this way now uh, for example so let me remove this or uh, yeah so for example what if I want to generate uh, the key as 0 1 2 3 or 1 2 3 and so on so in order to do that right if you want to generate it as uh, 0 1 2 3 and so on you can simply type the index right because this is this key value pair is there at the zeroth index and this is at the first index and this is at second index for example if you want to generate it as a if you want to start these keys with 1 2 3 and so on then you can simply uh, add it as index plus one right so that you see one two three and so on okay so this is how you can do now um, yeah so for example uh, let me remove this and now let us say uh, yeah so this is how uh, you can generate the key key keys uh, dynamically now let us go with the second approach so I'm copying this remove this so yeah issue with the double quotes right you got message one and message two for example yeah you can also replace this with index the same outcome you'll get an index plus one uh, you can 
you can change it uh, this way so this is the simpler one the first approach you can also go with the second approach okay and you can you can perform your logic in between this so that uh, the keys uh, will will get generated dynamically but your logic uh, should be appropriate one okay so this is how you can uh, generate the keys dynamically from input to the output this way so in order to go through it step by step you can go through this uh, small article okay i'll share this in the description of this video thank you so much for listening to my video have a good day